Welcome back to One Girl, One Gay. Welcome. The show that addresses the elephant in the room. Or the field. <laughs> Good one, Jennifer. Today we're so excited because we're taking you on our very first out trip to the Greater Vancouver Zoo. Yay! Yay! Zoo's rules! Zoo's rules! So no worries. Um, it's been great. And... Head into the Greater Vancouver Zoo, home of many species. And you know, I have mixed feelings about this because I feel like animals in captivity are really difficult for me to witness. But at the same time, I feel like I need the exposure, like the animal therapy and their vibes into my life because I'm just that worried ever since COVID. Everything's so dangerous. It's beautiful out here, wow. I love that mixed weather where it's like tempestuous but sunny. Tempestuous. <laughs> Christopher, what do you think about the weather? The weather's lovely. Special so guest star. Hey Carol. Hey. Carol Baskin. I don't know who that is. So the answer to your question is no. Beautiful little enclosure for the for the big cats, don't you think? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I like this part because there's no kids. I think it's called snouting for truffles. Yeah, do you think they plant truffles in there? Probably. So These guys seem happy. We should rate every animal and how happy they seem. Okay, what do you give these ones? Five out of five. Work, walk that runway. Work it. Hi, new friends. Those are two different species, right? One's a capybara, right? Capybara, that's from South America. Cute. I think. I love them. Yeah, me too. Their fur is unique. Conservation no, status, not assessed. <laughs> Cultural appropriation. Them. I believe it's shrimp. They eat mm -hmm. shrimp and that's why they're that color. So the zoo must be feeding them those shrimp. They can like stand on one leg for that long. Hey, I love them. Hey sweeties. They do look cool. old. They're shivering. I love the zoo. The zoo is enormous. This is it, yo. Could you imagine being the official zoo map illustrator? This we go through a mirror? Like I don't know. No, where let's the hell are we the going mirror. there? Let's skip the mirror. Like don't we just yes, look let's I don't everyone. like this weird mirror thing. I love to jump in the little balls and see all the animals. Wow, they're gorgeous. Yes. Magnificent. Here? Yeah. American elk. American elk. I'm so glad Prove I'm here. it. Canada geese, conservation status. Least concerned. <laughs> what could this be? It's a Chris. <laughs> conservation status. Least concerned. What? You're not but concerned? Only one of them. <laughs> I'm not concerned. There's cougars everywhere. So those that would be a rescue, right, Jennifer? Conservation status. Least concerned. Look at that beautiful Oh, they go across Chile. Wow. I, I hope that Chile, that yeah, build more and more parks for like green highways for the animals to migrate and cross breed across different sections of South America. And with other animals? No. Almost took my opportunity. Wow, it's so amazing over 
over here, Jennifer. I love this too. Just rub that. More often. Shut up. Uh, walk back. <laughs> 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 All important. If, and also, if if the country goes down the drain, what are we gonna eat for Christmas dinner? Geese. Yes. So Want me to call you honey? I'll call you dear. No, no, no. Okay. Do you believe in meditation? I do. Do you believe in petting wild animals? Yes. No. I don't know. Yes. Look at that. Aww. Hey, sweeties. Why? Oh, oh. This is unbearable. Oh. So cute. Are you guys coming? Not yet. <laughs> well, let's get a zoom in on the minutes. Gotta get there. What are these things? Just mirrors? I don't understand. <laughs> What's that? I did a zoom in of the mini donut sign. Yay! I feel like we need to have a, a donut. Let's have a taste. Matter? Oh, it's all kind of the same. I Where think. are my manners? Oh. Here you go. Take one of these and eat it. Every time the train goes by, poor guys and girls. Oh, there's another one right there. There's five of them oh in there. Oh my gosh, really? They just keep appearing. Yeah. into six because that seems pretty like met Ninja. metaphysical or about conservation and what else did you learn well just to appreciate an animal in front of me it's been so long and I would have to buy a plane ticket or go on a safari to see lions which arguably is not the best option either or even animals that do live here it's really neat to explore them a little bit and I like that the zoo does, we saw a sign, I think you were off buying mini donuts, but it, it told us about where the zoo animals came from and they were like um, from other zoos, from private owners who give them up. Like, and we have some local birds. Yes, local birds. Pets are for life. Pets, Pets are, are for, for life. life. Hi. Good, don't start your engine. We need your comments. This is Callum, he's a zookeeper. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you. Yes, we're so excited to be here. How long have you been working here? I've been working here nearly two years now. I detect a little bit of an accent. Is it from Canada? Uh, no, I'm from uh, the UK. Oh, cool. Wow. So how do you become a zookeeper? Uh, you need to go to university and get something related to conservation biology or wildlife biology. Um, that would be the first step. Um, if you can volunteer in any projects, um, there are some good websites, good uh, projects that you can be involved with. Um, and then after that, just applying, applying for positions. And I was lucky enough to get accepted for a position here. It's really covered. Oh yeah, there's a lot of comp competition for any jobs in wildlife. 
um, because a lot of it is volunteering. So finding a paid position that allows you to work in the field is is, is highly desired. Do you think my friend over here looks like uh, Karen Baskin? Karen Baskin? Or Carol Baskin from Tiger uh, King. I can't say that, no way. <laughs> What's one thing that you like the most about working at the zoo? Ooh, um, that uh, there's always opportunity to put forward some changes. So like if you have any enrichment ideas, for example, the... Uh, Yay. Thank you so much. No worries. You guys okay, care, yeah? have a great day. <laughs> Tangential. <laughs> yes. I think that works for any of the. Levy, are you still there? Levy, we're almost done. Yeah, that's a good boy. Do you see him? Yes, he's there. We'll be there really soon. Good boy. Be right back. I feel like we provided the zoo with extra, extra entertainment. OMG, did we ever? But see, like, we wake up like this. That's the problem. Yeah. I mean, I brush my teeth. Especially Chris. Yeah. <laughs> he gets to wake up like this. You're not least concerned. You're actually endangered. Oh, no. <laughs> Pretty good. Ooh, grizzly gifts. Got money? Jennifer? I'm just thinking about that bus driver again. You want to steal more lunches? I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm not such a hugger. That's the thing I discovered during COVID. Oh yeah? It's like, I like the distance. <laughs> <laughs> 